Some females are after more than sex. They want more than equal rights. They want to beat males at their own game. And they take them on every inch of the way. Africa's plains are among the most macho places on earth. Their testosterone fueled battlefields. Swaggering males scrap and fight for food and for the right to mate. In the thick of this maelstrom, few animals can mix it up like the hyena. Or seem as mixed up as the hyena. Late afternoon, a group of spotted hyena take it easy after a meal. The day's hot, the family relaxed. The head of the clan swaggers past, bristling with testosterone, its penis swings low and proud. With its confident rolling gait, this is one cocksure killer. But this well-hung hunter has a secret. He is a she. This is the queen of the swingers. Her huge member, which many males would be proud to bear, is in fact a clitoris. A closer look at this family reveals there's not a male member in sight. This family is a sisterhood, a fierce one. These females are some of the most masculine in the world. Sniffing reinforces family bonds, and there's no smell on earth quite like this. At the fetal stage, female hyenas come into contact with high levels of male hormones, and it causes more than hair on their chest. These low-slung clitorises are even capable of an erection. To add to the confusion, they also have a scrotum-like sac bulging with fat and tissue. It's covered with a thicker thatch of hair than that on a male's testicles. With no external vagina, they urinate, mate, and give birth through a canal running down the center of this shaft. <laughs> 